Greetings class, we have now completed unit three and are now moving on to unit four together. So let's recap. I hope that you enjoyed seeing exactly where your time was spent by completing our real schedule time management handout. We will definitely use this information this week when we finish learning about some time management strategies. You had a chance to hear from Holly Schumacher, our fabulous financial aid counselor, who always keeps us up to date on our financial aid information. If you ever want to make an appointment to see her uh, to get your financial aid questions answered, you can do so in E17. You also completed your first quiz, you guys, so congrats on that. You did so well. All the material in units one through three was fair game for the quiz, so that format will continue to be used in future quizzes. So for this week, we will be finishing up time management and also moving on to our values. I've also provided you some information on future assignment, which is due in two weeks. I want you to have enough time to do it. It's a presentation and I know you're going to do a fabulous job. So first we have a few tips on using Google Drive and Google Docs. Um, and being able to download your course um, documents each week in order to upload them to Canvas on time. Then some students were asking me about their Google site URL and also how to access um, other students' pages. So I've created a short video for you to understand how to do that, which is nice to see what everybody else is doing. Then, uh, let's see what's next, campus resources and locations. I've also included this because I uh, just want to make sure everybody has the locations of things on campus, on the Compton College campus. Uh, in case you didn't get everything last uh, week, I want you to know where all the resources are on campus. So then we have um, time management strategies. Uh, we're going to do some reflection on managing our time and then decide on how to prioritize our time better moving forward. That's the after monitoring your time. So hopefully you can find out where you spent most of your time. Some students tell me that they didn't realize just how much time they spent playing video games, while other students, after doing that assignment, they say, well, they didn't really realize how much time they don't have to sleep. So when we take those insights into consideration, we can implement appropriate time management strategies this week to improve our schedules. So after you reflect, then you'll be able to make an accurate ideal schedule. This is an ideal schedule because in this schedule you hypothetically have enough time to do the most important tasks and study for two hours per course unit that you are enrolled in. Once you have created your ideal schedule, then you will create an electronics calendar in Google Calendar and hopefully you're able to implement those ideal um, strategies and use your calendar for the rest of the semester. So ta-da, it'll help you if you use it. Then we're gonna move on to our values. We will move on to this short little activity and write-up and reflection on values because uh, we are about to delve into our goals and our values should line up directly with our goals. This helps us to feel like we are on track in life. So that's that assignment there. Lastly, we have, like I said, our instructional video on our goals and our dream board oral presentation and my life plan assignment, which is going to be due in two weeks. So let me know if you have any questions. Please manage your time because although your assignments are um, due on Sunday, you don't want to wait until the last minute to do them. Um, and I always suggest logging on on Monday, reading through the unit and planning out when you will do your various assignments so you can do them correctly and get full credit. So have a good, great week. Scroll down and click next to continue. And I am always here to answer your questions. Take care, guys. Bye.